Hi, it's me again, the preacher from the Philippines. And uh, good morning to all of you, my dear viewers, subscribers, uh, all those who are bound to be tormented in hell, all those who are confused, um, atheists, mockers, blasphemers. And um, how are you? Especially you, Mr. P Channel and Winham 666. In you too, Mr. Uh, Muspiano. You see, I'm indeed wondering why the three of you are still alive. You must be in hell now, being tormented, burned alive, for mocking, blaspheming God. Why God is still sustaining your life? Why are you still breathing? Well, that is God's decision, not mine. It is just a matter of time, Mr. P. Channel, when I'm 666 and most piano. You two, Rivers on the Moon, Roderick Asser, and uh, Crucifixion too. It's just a matter of time, my dear uh, viewers and subscribers, before you will be tormented in hell. So, I am advising you to enjoy the remaining years, days and months of your life. One of these days, you will see Satan in hell. While you are being tormented, while you are being burned, it is his time to mock and laugh at you for being so full. Well, the, the, the title of my message for today is Unbelievers, Lois K. in hell. Yes, not one of you will escape the wrath of God. Not one of you, I'm telling all of you now, for blaspheming, mocking God. Well, I got all your message. Uh, Chaos Lord 88, Elite 227, Atheist at Lords, Atheist at Lords, okay. And Lupo Sepalik, Cola Atheist, okay, Kick. Four tricks, Akuitama, Private Kipau, Rapmatic, and Ungor uh, Habari, Passion of Deities, are too bad. And um, Maltes Sepalcon 83, Norpax, and uh, P Channel, P Channel, you know, you are the most confused atheist in YouTube. You know why? At first, you said you don't believe in God. You deny God, and then your last comment, you believe in God, but he's dead. What a confused man you are, Mr. P. Channel. Mr. P. Channel. It's just a matter of time now, my dear uh, viewer. Don't worry. Not one of you will escape hell. Hell is now waiting for all of you. Especially you, the channel, you in Ham 666, you must piano, Roderick Asser, Night Shadow, the Posepoli. Not one of you will escape hell. Hell. Combinator 2, I got your message too. Roderick Asser, why did God create you? Why? All of you listen to me now. All of you atheists and Muslims and Buddhists, all of you Mormons, all of you Roman Catholics, all of you who practice Islam, Jehovah's Witnesses. Why did God create you? There is a reason for that. To share His glory. To share His glory. He prepared the mansions for all of you. Where you, all of you will be walking in that streets of gold. Where there is no more sin. No more sickness, no more diseases, no more pain. But because you are so arrogant and boastful and very proud, you will miss that chance. I'm telling all of you, but instead you will all be born in hell. Of course, if you will change your mind now and begin to bow down to this great God, begin to acknowledge your sin, begin to acknowledge you cannot save yourself 
that only God can save you. Only Jesus Christ, only the blood of Jesus Christ can save you now. Okay, symbolic. Why not put the, the Hindus second or third in your list? You know what, Mr. Symbolic? Sir, you are not that worst. Like P Channel and Winam 666, like most piano. These atheists are the worst of the worst. I know you are just confused. But I'm telling you, sir, God loves you so much. God is waiting for you to bow down and, and, and accept Him as your Lord and Savior. Don't, do not be like this atheist who are so full, manipulated and brainwashed by Satan. There is a big chance for you, Mr. Symbolic. You see, I'm tell I have to tell you this now. Anybody who does not like to accept Jesus Christ, anybody who deny God, anybody, I don't care who you are or what you are. You might be a Hindu, you might be a Buddhist, you might be a, a Muslim, you might be a Mormon, you might be a Roman Catholic, you might be a Jehovah's Witnesses, you might be Hare Krishna, you might be Scientologist, you might be a member of Oprah Winfrey or Tom Cruise. You might be a church, belong to the church of Satan. All of you will be burned in hell. It doesn't matter who you are or what you are. It's the symbolic. Make up your mind. Not one of you will escape the wrath and judgment of God. All of you at Whether you like it or not, you will face this great God. You will stand before God after suffering in hell, after being tormented in hell, where the pain doesn't go away, where there is there will be nothing of tears on judgment day, all of you will be standing before God and it will be the greatest shock of your life why for being so fool you will come to realize that how you wish you believe this great God how you wish you acknowledge and bow down to this great God when you will see this great God the almighty God the creator of the universe sitting on his great throne You will all be shocked. His name, Jesus Christ. Remember this, Jesus Christ, the only name, the only way, the truth and the life. You are so ungrateful. Jesus Christ did the worst when he died on the cross, when he suffered. He paid the full penalty of your sins before God. But you are so ungrateful. So what salvation awaits for all of you at these mockers and blasphemers of God? What chances awaits for all of you? And after that, you know what will happen? One by one, all your names will be called. And then you will hear these words. Leposepalik, I do not know you. When I'm 666, I do not know you. Musbiano, I do not know you. Roderick Asser, I do not know you. Liquid Head, I do not know you. Rapmatic, I do not know you. And all of you at these and blasphemers. Depart from me, ye blasphemers and mockers. These are the exact words of Jesus Christ that you will hear. Rap Mati, I got your question, sir. If God repopulated this planet from only eight souls, where did this Chinese come from? The Americans? The Europeans, the Indians, sir, there is a question for that. I'm going to answer that on my next video. Thank you so much.